supposed to act like I don't see the camera. Come on, let's continue. Play continue. We ready. Leaving Oxford, heading over to UK, get this one in. You might want to get her. No! You're supposed to trade. Like she been to school before. She know you're supposed to trade. Mm. What's that? Mm. Oreo dickers. Why do I have that? Here you go. You gonna snatch. Uh -uh. <laughs> Don't like. I like celery though. But you can never go wrong with the Oreo dippers. I'll be a spokesperson for this. Oreo dippers. The handy snack. Seatbelts should be securely fastened at this time. to me and and I'm telling you guys this right now I'm sitting in there and I'm going over some things in my head as I'm just finished obviously the board I'm in there writing down some stuff in my notes to get us ready in case they do something what we're gonna adjust to and I hear your energy in here and that excites me that excites me to know that I have a team that's ready to play it excites me to know we have a team that's come to Lexington Kentucky to win because that's where our program is going each and every day it's amazing how years change. You're 11 and three. You're one and zero in the SEC, but you still have a long way to go. You guys have watched TV and games on TV for many years saying, I'm gonna play on TV one day. And when I do, I'm gonna do this, this, and this. Go do it and have fun and do it. Because I'm telling you, you've arrived and it's time to show everybody what we're made out of. Let's go. Kentucky welcoming in Ole Miss for the home opener in conference play. The Wildcats are fired up for this one. They have won 10 in a row here in Lexington, Kentucky. Matt Insel, a name familiar to Kentucky fans, a longtime assistant here. He's very familiar with this venue. This is going to be a very up-tempo game. Push and press. Get your seatbelts on. It's toughness, and you gotta fight. 
You fought for eight minutes there. And I'm proud of you for that. But you gotta break even more fight every four, and you gotta turn it up just a little bit more. And you have to be so sound and disciplined defensively, and you have to rely on that. And for 20 minutes, you did it pitcher perfect. But that's half the battle. Half the battle has been won. And you've played marvelous so far. But you're 20 minutes from one of the biggest wins of your, of your career in college. And go out here and let's take it. I'm really, really proud of every one of you. You fought through adversity. There's a lot of things that went against you in that game, but you kept fighting. Keep your head up. I don't want to see nobody with your head down. It should hurt. It's going to hurt us, but it's going to hurt us to Tuesday, and we're going to get on that practice court on Tuesday and get it back. All right, let's go.